Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel Zabel Explains. In today's video, we are diving into some of the biggest cyber attacks in history. These cyber incidents have had a massive impact on companies or governments and even entire countries. We will cover what happened, how it happened and most importantly, what can we learn from them to improve cybersecurity. From ransomware that crippled hospitals to data breaches exposing millions of personal records, we will explore several notorious cyber attacks that shook the world. Stick around to the end because you will get some key takeaways to protect yourself from similar threats. So let's get started. Number 1. 2017 WannaCry Ransomware Attack The first attack on our list is the infamous WannaCry Ransomware Attack. This attack took place in May 2017 and quickly spread across the globe, infecting over 230,000 computers in 150 countries. Here's what happened. WannaCry exploited a vulnerability in Microsoft's Windows operating system which was originally discovered by NSA National Security Agency. The ransomware would encrypt users' files and demand a Bitcoin ransom to unlock them. It particularly affected industries like healthcare with the UK's National Health Service NHS being hit the hardest. They had to cancel surgeries and appointments due to the attack. The vulnerability had actually been patched by Microsoft two months prior to the attack but many systems hadn't been updated making them prime targets. This attack showed the importance of timely patching and updating software systems. It also emphasized how vulnerable critical infrastructures like healthcare can be to cyber attacks. Number 2 2013 Target Data Breach In 2013, retail giant Target suffered a massive data breach that exposed the credit and debit card information of over 40 million customers. Here's how it happened. Attackers managed to gain access through Target HVAC vendor by exploiting weak security in their system. Once inside Target's network, they installed malware on point-of-sales POS systems allowing them to steal customer data as it was being processed. The breach was particularly damaging because it occurred during the holiday shopping season when millions of transactions were being processed daily. The fallout was huge with Target facing over $162 million in expenses related to the breach. The company's reputation also took a hit and several executives including the CEO resigned. Lessons learned This case showed how important it is to secure third-party vendors and monitor point-of-sale systems. Many breaches occur when attackers find a backdoor through an unprotected vendor or weakly secured partner. Number 3 Sony Pictures Hack Next on our list is the Sony Pictures Hack of 2014. This attack had a unique political angle as it was reportedly carried out by the North Korea in responses to the Sony's release of the film The Interview, a comedy about a plot to assassinate North Korean leader Kim Jong-un. Here's what happened. Hackers who identified themselves as the Guardians of Peace infiltrated Sony's system and leaked confidential data. This included unreleased movies, scripts, personal emails from executives and employee data. The attackers threatened to release more data if Sony didn't pull the film from the theaters. Although some theaters cancelled showings, Sony eventually released the film online. The hack caused major embarrassment for Sony and resulted in millions of dollars in damages both financially and to its reputation. Sony was forced to increase its cybersecurity budget significantly after the attack. This attack highlighted the need for stronger internal security controls including encrypting sensitive data and improving incident response. It also demonstrated how cyber attacks can be used as political tools. 2017 Equifax Data Breach Another major attack was the Equifax data breach in 2017, one of the largest breaches of personal data in history. Over 143 million Americans had their social security numbers, birth dates, and addresses exposed. Here's how it happened. 
Attackers exploited a vulnerability in the Apache Struts web application framework using by Equifax. The vulnerability was publicly disclosed months earlier, but Equifax failed to apply the patch in time. Once inside, the attackers gained access to a database filled with sensitive consumer information. The breach raised questions about how secure personal data is, especially in the hands of large corporations. Equifax faced numerous lawsuits and had to pay hundreds of millions of dollars in settlements. This case stresses the importance of patch management and securing web applications. It also highlights the need for transparency and swift communication with the public when a breach occurs. 2020 Twitter Bitcoin Scam In July 2020, Twitter experienced a high-profile Bitcoin scam that targeted some of the most well-known accounts on the platform including Elon Musk, Barack Obama and Bill Gates. Here's what happened. Hackers gained access to Twitter's internal tools by tricking employees into sharing their login credentials in a social engineering attack. They used these tools to take over high-profile accounts and post messages asking followers to send Bitcoin, promising to double their money. Over $100,000 was sent to the hacker's Bitcoin wallet before Twitter was able to regain control of the account. This attack wasn't as large in financial terms, but it showed the power of social engineering and how vulnerable even major platforms like Twitter can be. This case demonstrated the need for multiple factor authentication and employee training on recognizing phishing and social engineering schemes. Number 6 Solar Winds Supply Chain Attack One of the most sophisticated attacks in recent years is the Solar Winds Supply Chain Attack in 2020. This attack compromised thousands of organizations including government agencies and Fortune 500 companies. Here's what happened. Attackers believed to be state-sponsored managed to inject malicious code into SolarWinds Orion software, a widely used network monitoring tool. The compromised software update was pushed out to SolarWinds customers, creating a backdoor for hackers to infiltrate their systems. Major US government agencies like the Department of Homeland Security and Treasury Department were affected with the attackers spying on sensitive data for months. The SolarWinds attack highlighted how vulnerable the software supply chain can be as organizations often trust updates from their vendors without second thoughts. This attack showed the importance of supply chain security and the need for companies to vet third-party vendors carefully. It also emphasized the need for better monitoring and detection of suspicious activities within the network. Key takeaways in conclusion, as we have seen, cyber attacks can take many forms from ransomware to social engineering to supply chain hacks. Each of these incidents teach us valuable lessons about how to improve cybersecurity. Here are a few key takeaways. Patch your systems regularly to close vulnerabilities. Secure your third-party vendors and ensure they follow best practices. Train employees to recognize phishing and social engineering attempts. Implement strong encryption and access controls to protect sensitive data. Continuously monitor networks for unusual activity. That's it for today's video. Uh, if you have found this information helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe for more cybersecurity content. And if you want to learn more about protecting yourself from cyber threats, check out our other videos. Thanks for watching and stay safe out there.